I always say to myself that I want to be the person that my younger self needed, and for me, that was Maggie. Hey, my name is Lore. I am a content creator living in the greatest city in the world, and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'll take you all around New York City, and I'll record it all on my camera. Please enjoy today's video. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe. What is good, fam? So if you guys have been watching my videos for a while, you know that I'm absolutely obsessed with Maggie McDonald. I think she is probably one of the coolest people I have ever seen. I think she is beautiful, she is talented, she is smart, she is just like a boss woman, you know what I mean? And because of all of that and so much more, I decided that it would be fun to recreate some of her Instagram photos today. These are the three Instagram pictures that I am recreating of Maggie's and I'm so excited. So from watching Maggie's videos, I know that she does not really like to do a lot of like heavy makeup when she's going out and almost all the pictures that I'm taking are of her out and about on the town, whatever. So I'm just gonna do some like minimal makeup, you know, gotta cover those acne scars, whatever. And yeah, it's gonna be so much much fun. I'm super excited and oh, I just love her. She's awesome. So let's get into it. Okay, so I did some very light makeup and I'm actually in the first outfit right now. I'm super excited. Oh my god, I hope Maggie like watches this. That would be so cool. I'm gonna pack a bag with all the outfits because of course I'm recreating her winter looks. Like they're iconic. So we have like some sweatshirts, sweatpants, and let's get going. Good girl? Wait, you didn't get my dad, Taylor. <laughs> Okay, so it is much later in the day now, but I am back home and I need to sift through the pictures that we took today. I was looking through them in the car ride home and they actually look pretty good for recreating. So let's sift through the pictures and see which ones we need to edit. I think we're gonna be editing on Visco because that's how Maggie said she edits her pictures. So I think it should be good. I have to Photoshop some things to make it look a little bit more realistic, but um, yeah, I think it's gonna be really great. So of course I watch all of Maggie's videos, but one video that I know I personally requested and so many other people did as well, was the how I edit my Instagram photos because she just has a, such a nice white clean aesthetic. I actually used to have a white theme on my Instagram and I took a lot of my inspiration from her. So shout out Maggie, we love you. So she posted this video in March and I know that she uses two specific filters on Visco to get the kind of look of the pictures that she has on her Instagram. So first she uses C1, but not too much. And then she re-imports the picture and uses A4, I think, yeah. Um, just to give it like a bright white feel. So that's what we're gonna do with all the pictures. I hope it works. So we are importing these three pictures and I'm excited to get started. So this was the first picture that I wanted to recreate of Maggie. She's just wearing her classic, you know, super puff from Aritzia. I did not have that, but I did have a puffy black jacket. So I'm just going to try to recreate the coloring because I mean, not gonna lie, this outfit looks pretty close to Maggie's. Like obviously everything, it's not the same brand and whatever, but I had the white tank with the, like the cutoff. I had the sweatpants that were gray, a black puffy jacket and like some Converse. So it works, whatever. So let's go in first and do some C1 because that's what she says she uses first, but she does not turn it up all the way. Okay, so now we have the already edited with C1 and we're gonna put A4 on top of it. And now we are also just going to throw the photo in Lightroom so we can get a little bit of like a brighter white feel to it. I just want to like take the whites up a little bit just because her background is like super, super white. So this was the next picture that I recreated of Maggie's and honestly, I think it came out pretty pretty good. We do have to Photoshop a little bit just so I can add a little bit more. I don't know. I just thought it'd be kind of cute to add some extra stuff to it. So let's throw on a four and definitely turn up the contrast and saturation a little bit. After I'm done editing the last picture, I'm going to Photoshop the bottle and vlog camera onto the table. So this is our last pick. Let us throw on some C1 and see where we're at. 
Okay, sorry, I had to turn the light on because I didn't realize that the sun was going down and it just got a little too dark, but let's keep going with the picks. Okay, so now that we have imported the second round, let's go back into the little visco filters and get some A4 on this girl. I wanna take the green out because Maggie's picture was obviously taken not where I took mine, but if I take the green out of the pictures, I think I should be able to replicate the buildings to some extent. So let's go to green and let's turn the saturation down. Oh, that looks gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, so last step before we compare everything is Photoshop the bottle and the vlog camera onto the second image. I mean, that looks pretty real to me. All right, save. All right, guys, so here is the final reveal of all of the pictures. I think I was able to edit them pretty well. I mean, it's obviously not perfect, but... Okay, guys, so here is the reveal for the first picture. This is Maggie against the white wall. I think I look a little bit more orange than she does just because mine is makeup that's on my face and hers was like an actual tan, I guess. It's all good. I think the outfit... I executed pretty well and location wise we got the gray floor with the white background I think it looks pretty good next my personal fave so this is the recreation for number two I am actually so happy with how this one turned out I'm happy I was able to get the bottle and vlog camera onto the table and I think we're pretty much doing the same pose obviously my hair is a little bit longer than Mag well it's a lot longer than Maggie's but I also was able to photoshop the background of where she was at in Boston Seaport kind of onto my background so it kind of had the same color I don't know this one had a little photoshop in it but I think it came out pretty pretty well and then lastly we have number three which is just the street photo again outfit pretty good like I pretty much got these outfits down I mean obviously like I said it's not gonna be the same brands and everything like that I'm pretty proud of these I think they turned out pretty good not gonna lie leave a comment down below which one was your favorite recreation mine personally was the second one but yeah I think it turned out pretty well so that is gonna be the end of today's video I was so so excited to do this video for such a long time and of course I had to pick my queen Miss Maggie McDonald you guys should definitely check out her YouTube Instagram she's incredible one of my biggest inspirations ever and I am just so lucky to have a role model and such a beautiful strong boss woman that I get to look up to on YouTube because she is incredible so I definitely recommend you guys check her out if you don't know who she is if you guys have been watching me for a while you know that I'm absolutely obsessed with Maggie and I just think she is so beautiful and she's such a nice role model to look up to I always say to myself that I want to be the person that my younger self needed and for me that was Maggie I definitely needed her at the time in my life that I found her and she seriously inspired so many things like me losing 20 pounds in a month, just like getting into a really strict routine, just like knowing my worth and knowing that I can be just as boss as anybody else can. And she's just amazing. Like I literally want her to mentor me one day because she is so incredible. I look up to her so much. My friends can tell you I talk about her and Arlen, Gretchen, Emma, like I talk about them all the time. So yeah, this was so much fun and I'm really happy with how the pictures turned out. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, leave a like, comment down below. If you don't want to, I don't really care and I will see you guys in next week's video. Bye! Baby, this is simple. Baby